Uh, hello everyone, this is another Start Pro Connect Edition tutorial. In this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to link IDEA Statica software to Start Pro Connect Edition. So, IDEA, IDEA Statica software is a very powerful finite element analysis and design of connection, as well as uh, there is a lot of enhancement on the element and member design, and also some uh, cross sections. Now, for this uh, tutorial, you should have uh, two software. Firstly, Idea Statica that you have to install in your device, and secondly, Start Pro. After you do install the uh, Idea Statica, then you can open it and come to this first here beam. In the beam, click on the activate your beam, and it will be asking you to uh, run as administrator. Yes, and then you will check a list of those elements that program will will support. So you can come to here. And finally, you will find your uh, Start Pro Connect Edition installed software here. Uh, in this will be uh, an install. So you, then you can call it install. When you clicked, and you will see this command this green highlight. And then you can close this software. And so there is no need, and you can cl close it. After that, come. You first uh, run the analysis of your model. So this is a very simple uh, model which is already analyzed, and you also can conduct the design as well after design and or before the design. But the analysis must be completed, and then you come to the utility here, and in configures you can come here. You create a new name. This is called uh, idea. Let me write in capital idea static. Then you can uh, come to the this one command and you can go to the, the directory that you installed the software since so program file uh, idea static and then comes to the this one idea connect could check manager so okay. And then you can uh, give that uh, directory here in initial directory. You can go back to here and then just give idea static. Okay. And then, okay. Now the program is activated in your user tool. And you can come to here uh, to transfer or export the structure there. So I should say there is two methods in, in the some newest version of the idea statica. Uh, there is a loss of enhancement uh, in the same method is also or can be applied for the other software as well you have uh, two choice to transfer this model you can select one single nodes with the members and then design the connection or you can select the entire structure but there is you should remember when you select this member you can come to right click and you have to click the geometry cursor so then geometry cursor then you exactly will select this node and this member and this member you can see here the member one member or element is one element and so two three elements and one node is selected in case if you are in this cursor using this beam so then you will select these things and you selected these four members without node so the program will not show you this one so this is a tricky part now you also can select come back again to the geometry cursor and select the entire structure so the good thing is now the program can uh, select all the structure and then in the idea statica you can conduct the connection design one by one so i can select all let's go to here idea statica and it will transfer to the program so the program will start opening and it's automatic so the i selected the entire structure so it's a loss of element node and beam columns so it take time in case if your device is uh, much more uh, better so that will be quite faster so after that you will see this uh, element and you can see here 
the entire uh, structure is uh, numbered and also selected the, the connection you can see base and also any of this connection uh, so there is uh, a lot of tutorial in my youtube channel you can uh, see how you can design uh, uh, moment resisting connection shear connection anything you want you want so you can come to here in the connection and you first select one of them one connection you want and after that you can select one or this one. you can go to first connection uh, to fix some some codes and also some uh, design codes and materials so uh, this program this one already was uh, opened and it's not going back so in case if you uh, if, if it's first time then it will go to check that code but my code is already AIC design AIAC design code and I'm going to select this base and I'm going to open it so double click and it will be open now the new page is created which I selected the base So here is now the actually the user interface of the program which we will design. Now here is the program. So you can see the uh, the, the column member is member ninety three and it's W ten times thirty and everything and the load the load case we just came from the analysis and second load also we have unbalanced force as well now. We want to create uh, because it's a base. I'm going to connect it to uh, base. So when you right click again in the second one, it will you see this one. So you can choose which one is uh, correct for you. So let me select this one and double click, and it should be okay. And now you can. Uh, choose the, the default bolt is here you can add go to add and you can see the multiple size of the uh, bolts and also the concrete blocks which uh, concrete size you want and just as a, as, as a default I can keep this one and you can see that automatically the program determined the base connection so in case for without any uh, changing on the, on the properties of this uh, base so I can run the analysis and see how the, with this default uh, configuration looks like uh, so with this configuration which is uh, now loading and the program I run the analysis and it's quite okay and the uh, shear strength is also okay uh, concrete block is okay well is okay anchor is not calculated because it's not supporting the anchor analysis and the analysis is complete 100% so with these properties with this uh, configuration so this block and this base connection can satisfy the uh, the this structure this base okay and also you can apply the same things for entire structure uh, or you can uh, select other connection other base or foundations because uh, mostly in the in the age the column is least so in this in the center or interior column is quite large amount of moments and also shear so like this you can perform and you can uh, go to create a report and also the, do checking everything and I also I can go to uh, check overall check here And you can see the stress string and the bolt force uh, machine as well current stress plastic string everything you can see so but it's quite safe now uh, one thing in sometimes you will get error in case if you uh, in the material properties when you define this steel because this is a default steel and the yield string and ultimate string is not properly defined so that you should uh, give a uh, specific steel materials so in this study you can see 
steel material is giving 355 newton per square meters millimeters so or 355 megapascal so this is the end of the tutorial and uh, if you have any question please put it in the comment and you'll find time to answer you see you next time